So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today guys, I bring you a location where I haven't seen anybody else cover, which beholds two, inc well, three items, two of them utterly incredible and you won't want to miss them. I mean, check this out guys, check this out. <laughs> That's my torch. That is my torch doing that. And I can set fire to everything. Today we're getting to it all. How's it going, guys? My name's DPJ. And if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so you get this, which is utterly amazing. The steel wire torch. I mean, just to be used in those dark places because, you know, when things are just you know when things are dark you just you just want to see shit and then we get the claymore which is a an amazing an amazing sword let me just show you its uh main ability check this out whoop, whoop, whoop. boom you know that deals some damage you can't wait to take this to the smithy and level it up i can't wait so you get these two yeah you get the um the uh blah, 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 fire breather it's called well, Fire Breath is actually the ability's name. It's just like a torch. But that's so good. You get that and a claymore. As well as a fair calling finger a remedy, which is something to do with PvP. I mean, it reveals co op and hostile summoning signs. So, yeah, you get that at the same time here. So, this is where you gotta go. So, you need to come to where I'm at the map right here. So, you need we actually need to get down to there. And to do so, you need to come here first. Castle, Morn, Rampart. Now you start the game here. So if you come down, come down, keep coming down, you'll eventually get to this part here. Now, guarding this castle is one ginormous boss with a ginormous crossbow. You don't even want to fight him. So I've actually had to come here to get out of his way. So we just summon our, our trusted mount and we just run towards it. We just keep going guys, we just keep going. You'll see him here. You can also reveal this part of the map via this thing right in front of me here. So don't forget that. Now you will actually see, well you probably see the, the giant uh, arrows coming towards me before you see the boss. There you go. Jesus, yeah. So you see what I'm saying? You don't want to get hit by that dude. You just do not want to get hit by that dude. Can I breathe on my horse? No, I thought I could breathe by that. Oh shh. Yeah, but we actually have to get past him. We'll collect that shiny while we're here. So we don't fight this dude because that wouldn't be wise. We need to just run around him. So we wait for him to draw his bow here. So let him draw, let him draw. Draw, go and shoot, shoot. And just avoid it and go up the steps. And just run through here. And you can't actually shoot through these doors, so you're, you're quite safe. So you're lucky about that. And then you want to activate this without a shadow of a doubt. So grab that. No, guys, I actually ain't been in here. I ain't been in here. I don't think there's anything uh, special in here anyway, but yeah. Either way. Okay, so. I actually put some more stuff away because I'm way over. I'm way too heavy. <laughs> I got so much stuff on me. So let me just uh, put you away. That should be good. There we go, so go up the lift. And here guys, we are basically creeping because there's a ton of enemies here. And you probably won't survive them this early on. If you're an early player, so yeah. So what we do here, I'm going to put my torch away as well. I see the enemies, so just creep. This side here, Castle Morn. We don't want to get clocked by these dudes because they hit pretty hard. We're not the little guys, but the main guy up there, you can see. He hits relatively hard, so you just sneak this way. Just sneak this way, keep sneaking. And for some reason, they don't see you. You can see they're burning, sacrificing up there. Yeah, we don't we don't intervene, we, we stay out of their way. And then you come this way here. So right here, guys, behind this door, within this chest, will be a claymore. The sword, I just showed you, so grab that. And once you're done, we go this way. We go this way. Again, guys, you... I mean, you can just sneak here. Or you can just run. I can't remember, actually remember dying here, to be honest. Well, I've taken me either way. 
Okay, so you just sneak, sneak, and run up this, get up the ladder quick, quick as possible. Now these guys will follow you up this ladder. They will follow you up this ladder. So once you get to the top, this is what you want to do. This is what you want to do. See they're coming? Sneaky bastards. So you want to run and jump up here. And what they'll do is they'll draw the attention uh, from that battle over there. And then just, oh shit, don't jump back down. Let me just wait here. And from here, guys, you can see that glowing light. That's what we're going to go and grab. So once all the... Well, whenever, whichever enemy's left, you jump down and slay them. It's not hard at all. But then one comes up here and tries it with you, just take him out. I mean, it ain't hard. I don't hit too hard either, so you're good. You're good. So, yep, then you jump down, guys, and obviously just take them out. And just get on with it, people. Get on with it, and then you'll see... Once you've grabbed that, there's two more enemies at the back there, which are obviously holding, uh, blocking this amazing torch, which you want to get. So yes, guys, take them out and grab that torch. And it is as simple as that, people. And that is how you get these amazing two items which you just need in your life for sure. It's basically a flamethrower and a beastly ass sword. So yeah, guys, that's the video. And I hope you... Uh, enjoyed it if you did leave a like it really helps me out if you're new around here and want to see more out of the ring be sure to subscribe and hopefully people i will see you on that next one